find the depth in furlong of the ocean if the pressure at the seabed is 2,000 kilopascals. Now this is a rather simple question because we know what a furlong is. Well, a furlong is equal to about 201 meters or 660 feet for our American friends. We're also given the specific gravity of 1.03. Now this is seawater, so we can simply multiply this by the density of pure water. We end up with a density of 1030 kilograms per cubic meter. We're also given a pressure of about 2000 kilopascals. Now let's just put a little drawing here so we can understand what we're working with. This is what we're trying to find in furlongs. And the pressure given is right here, the bottom of the seabed. Now, if you remember, the pressure at a certain depth is given by P is equal to rho GH. Density of the substance multiplied by the gravitational acceleration multiplied by the depth. Now we are given the pressure at the seabed. We also have the density of our substance and we know the gravitational acceleration is 9.81. We don't know what the depth is. Now we can simply start putting our values in. This would be our pressure. Do note that this is in kilopascals, so we need to convert that by multiplying multiplying by a thousand. And that turns it into pascals. And then the density of our seawater. Times the gravitational acceleration. And of course the unknown is our H. Well, let's put that in our calculator. Then we just shift solve, and we get a depth of 201 meters. Now, remember, one furlong is exactly equal to 201 meters. So our height, or rather the depth of the ocean, is exactly one furlong. And that is our final answer. If this helps you, consider supporting the channel, and I'll see you in the next one.